what is good y'all it is me is and welcome back to a brand new part of the crybaby whims challenge and before we get into this video make sure you guys go ahead and leave a like comment and subscribe to this channel for more if you want to see more of me and more of crybaby whims and other stuff i have to offer for you guys but um anyway let's get right into the video so basically what i want to do in this part i want to focus more on Darren. So what I want Darren to do is um since it's New Year's, we're gonna take um Madeline out. That's what we're finna do. So like look, I bet Dean is feeling so uncomfortable. Cause I mean deep down inside, look, look, look at his daughter. He know deep down inside, he know he's the father of Chloe. Just look at them. Hold on. Uh, see, he even looking down. Y'all, I am weak. Look, y'all, y'all see how com uncomfortable he looks. Like, look at him. He's like, yeah, buddy. Um, you might want to, you know. You might want to, you know. Um, <laughs> might want to, you know, get a paternity test on her because. Yeah, L look at her. And look at me. Oh Lord, child. Oh, let's see. Let's see if we um get anything. Let's click on Chloe. Um, see, look. You see how she already has a good relationship with him. Maybe she'll gravitate towards him. Let's see. Uh, it says already hug lovingly. Let's do it. She probably won't even recognize the difference. Because, you know, she is the best, so she probably won't know. But, you know, a baby always knows who their other parent is. She's. She, uh, look how. She's like, why do I look so much like him? Like. Um. This is weird. Like, mommy, why do I look like uncle? Look at her. She's just like, she She knows something's up. Oh, I should have took Oh, I'm going to take a picture real quick. Because that is so adorable. Because, oh, I think he knows. I really do think. That this might be the day that all the drama just get unleashed because I think everybody's starting to catch on to it. Like, oh my god, Dean is meeting his um daughter for the first time. Oh my god, y'all. Wait, what? Not Good night, y'all. <laughs> um, this is just too much drama for me. I wonder, um, can we ask Dean? Like, like, what's up? I hear you. And um, Madeline began about cause like, yeah, I know you and her used to like date and whatever, but like, you know, I just wanna know what's tea. Look how he looking down at his own daughter. Like he he knows, yeah. The the T, the T, the T. Why can't I click on him? There we go. Cause come on, y'all yeah, think my game is broken, and I really do not want to restart with my CC, my CC, and my mods all over again. I I I. I just don't have it in me to do that. I'm sorry, y'all. I, I, I just can't. I don't have it in me to restart. That's why my shit is at seven, seven point twelve gigabytes. Of that's how much my mod is. Anywho, so anywho, um, I do. What is going on with my game? <sighs> I'm gonna kill myself, y'all. He, he can't ask nothing at all. 
as for you know what, let's do that. Let's ask for a DNA sample. Ooh. Yeah, we're gonna get our DNA sample and then um Maybe he might conduct his own little paternity test. Cause you know, he probably might be he probably is a little suspicious on her. Can we take a DNA sample from her? Okay, let's just pretend that the little um Let's pretend that the little snuggle is him taking a DNA sample from her. Like, oh my god, he's really taking a DNA sample. I can't believe Dean is allowing this. I bet Dean do doesn't even know what's going on. I bet mean, he's like, okay, dude, whatever. You can take your little DNA sample and whatnot. Uh, look, I bet, I bet Dean is lucky just that you know he get that um Darren is holding his daughter, but once again, y'all, Darren doesn't know that um Chloe is not his daughter. So um yeah, let's just say that was him taking um. Oh, she's upset. Okay, girl, we're gonna put you down because uh, we're gonna go on a date with mommy in a minute. So, um, yeah, let's just go take mommy on a date. Uh, I would kiss him if kiss him in front of Dean, but we don't want him to you know react differently because once again, let's not, let's remember y'all. This is The Sims, so mm, yeah. But, um, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and take Mallet out on our date, and, um, yeah, I'll meet you guys there. And, um, yeah, cause he probably, you know, I feel like Dean is suspecting that the relationship is falling. Like, I mean, if you look at the relationship, the relationship is good, but <laughs> let's face it, I, Darren is starting to catch on, especially because of their new baby girl that's born. I mean, look at her. I mean, she looks nothing like him. But I mean, like I said, my other part when I was talking about my relatives, lots of, it's lots of cases like this where you know the child might come out lighter, especially when it came to interracial couples. So, but yeah, but anywho, I'm gonna have um Darren go on a date with um. Do we want to go to a bar, a cafe? Um, I don't want to go right there because um. Let's go out of this. Mm, nah, we're, we go. We're gonna go here. Oh no, we can go to the um, nightclub. Or no, let's go to the art gallery. And that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna travel to the city. And we're gonna go to the art gallery. We're just gonna go there with Madeline. And we're just going to um, say that the kids, they are with um, Uncle Dean. But, that's the problem. Dean. Dean is the problem, y'all. But, um, yeah, let's just get into this tea. A question date, because, um, like I said, Darren, he's really starting to get suspicious. He already um, done collected, um... He collected a sample of like yeah he already done collected a sample of Dean's hair well not his hair but you know whatever whatever let's just pretend that he collected some of his DNA and um yeah he's gonna run and then he also collected DNA from um Chloe so he's just gonna run some tests on his own and basically, he's going to find out the hard truth. And then when he find out, he's going to confront Madeline about it and be like, well, I know I'm not the father of Chloe. And um, I want a divorce. Mm. 
But right now, we're just going to ask him a few questions. Uh, we're going to ask her a few questions. Woohoo wellness, because I know it's part of that. Um, express closeness with Dean. So, yeah, he's definitely finished his voice opinions about that. So did he did he did he even ask? Did it what, what what's going on? Did it like did it just cancel out when I had I think my game is broken, y'all. <laughs> Express closeness with about Dean, yes. All right, Whew. all right, let's see. All right, is he gonna like? Oh, oh, uh oh. I think Oh, I think he, I think uh, uh, Will she confess though? Will she confess to the affair? That's the question Oh, oh their relationship just decreased Oh my god Like, oh my god, he's really confronting her in front of everybody about this. Like, look, oh, yo, look at her face. She's like, uh oh, I just got caught. Yeah, I would be embarrassed too if I got caught cheating. Wait, 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 wait. Did she confess? Hold on, hold on. A fault conf Darren's partner cheated. Darren's partner just confessed to having woohoo with another. What should Darren do? Give the relationship and his partner a chance. It's too painful. A hopeless just break. Oh my god! Go. This is tea. Hmm, I feel like Darren, we won't leave her just yet. We won't leave her just yet. We'll give her one more chance. But let me read this whip. Um, uh, it's a fault confessed, half forgiven. Madeline doesn't feel the right Oh, shit. Oh wow. What is this a new one too? Off the hood. From giving a second chance. Oh my god. Fuck. Dang. Yo, y'all see their relationship? That just really took a huge jab at their relationship. Um. Oh, we get more choices. Um, yell at for cheating, threaten to break up, refuse to forgive for cheating. Oh my God! And then, uh, what else? Um, ask Mala to sever ties with the son that she cheated with. Ask. I feel like Darren. Darren would like to know why, because I mean he already got the results. We're just gonna say that he already took the lab results and everything. He did one of, those, one of those quick little tests, and yeah, he just found out that she cheated. And we're just going to ask her why, though. Oh, don't tell her that she's going to die from hysteria. Bro. If, she, if she dies, bro, um, we're just going to revive her, because no. But um, let's ask her why. Why did, you, like, why did you cheat on me? Like, did I do something wrong?
I need to go ahead and calm this girl down. Um, explain reasons for having cheated. Staleness and boredom. They seduced Mallet and she fell. They, oh, ooh. Mallet was intoxicated and it simply happened. I mean, that's what happened for, the, that's what happened the first time. Oh, wow. So what should we do? I feel like the I feel like I'm debating between she craves more attention or she was intoxicated because I mean the first time she was intoxicated. Hmm. I'm gonna just say that she craved more attention and affection. Like, oh, I like this mod. I, I, I'm most definitely going to like link this mod down below for you guys because, y'all, this is tea. Like, we're f like, oh my god, he finally, he's really finding out that she cheated. Uh, Darren, uh, Darren, calm down, sweetheart. Oh my god, this is, this is a lot, y'all. Okay, let's do, let's see what else can we do from Darren's perspective. And she's hysterical. We got I we definitely gotta calm her down before she dies. Um relationship wellness, what else can we ask? Hmm. And then we're going to ask her to um, sever her ties, basically, with Darren. I mean, with Dean. Girl, you better not laugh yourself to death. I swear to God, if you die on us. And now she's paranoid. It's almost Rylan's birthday. Okay, so Rylan's birthday, is, we're going to have it in the next part. Uh, are they? Is she literally arguing that she's not gonna? Are you serious? I'm leaving this behind. I'm leaving them behind. Let's start over. You're my partner. Don't worry about the no more. They're a thing of the past. Yeah, right, girl. Oh my God! Wait. Wait, wait, you're cutting ties with me because you're, <gasps> stay with them then, never come knock at my door again, uh, t whatever D, bye, <laughs> oh my god, let's, now let's look at these relationships that we got going on, okay, uh, let's see, Oh. Oh, that really, that really just took, oh my God. Oh my God. Wow, that just really took a turn. Okay. Mm, 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 mm. Um, basically I did, um, just to take... So just to take some little attention off the um, Sims right now on um, their little um whatever they got going on. So basically, okay, so I might be like, oh, I'm doing something wrong. No. So basically, I have put the relationship back up. But don't worry, guys. Don't worry. They're gonna get divorced soon. Don't worry because um basically my storyline with Dean and Madeline is basically those two they were just playing it off like oh they're breaking up their little affair between each other but they really not they just did it she just did they just doing it for show because I feel like they already had a um, motive that they was gonna get caught but 
Um, yeah, their spouses have forgiven him, but they're still gonna be knocking the boost around. Cause yeah, so that's where I'm going with this whole. Let me see if we got any sentiments for from Dean. Um, adore. And we're still boyfriend and girlfriend. They're still sweethearts, Nate. Mm -hmm. All right, let's see what we have towards our husband. Um, Darren. Um, Okay, so he's no longer um, feeling upset that we cheated on him no more. So that's good. That is, that is good. That is fine by me. Oh, okay, so since it is New Year's, I feel like, you know what? Well, New Year's Eve, Um, and they're having their nice little date. Uh, I'm going to just have them all just, you know, define their um, New Year's resolution. Because I never did that in The Sims. So, basically, what I want her um, resolution to be is complete. Hmm, let's see. Race skill. Lose weight, get fit. Um, I'll say let's um let's do that. Complete aspiration, and then um let's say his um aspiration it will be um his um New Year's resolution will be. Get a promotion. Yep. Alrighty, so let's just go ahead and end the date. Dean, uh, I enjoyed a conversation today. I feel like him and Dean um, will have a pretty sour relationship now. So let me just go ahead and... Um, Lower their relationship. So let's um. I'm gonna put them as um. They really dislike each other. So yeah. So him and Dean, they no longer are cool. All right, so um, let's just head back to the house, and uh, I'm gonna give um their kids um resolutions and whatnot. And I'm Heidi, I heard you, and yeah, um, he's he's uh, he's our husband, yeah, um, yeah, leave us alone. Okay, so we're back here, home. Um, I guess, I guess, oh my god, who is calling her now? I bet it's I bet it's Dean. How much you guys bet is Dean? No, it's Roger. Oh my god, you're dead. Leave us alone, dad. Okay, so let's um, do Raphael. Let's make his, um, let's see. Make his um, new resolution to be, become a better student. He he already has good grades. Wow. Um, complete aspiration. Um, raise a skill. Okay, that would be nice. And I don't think um toddlers can already can make a resolution. Wait, can they? Um, let's sign um her and her brother up for preschool. Well, right, ooh, um, private preschool, home, um, public preschool. Look, look at her. She's just like, oh my god. I can't really... <laughs> wow. I can't believe I just got caught up. Yes, uh, I mean, what did you expect? What did you expect? All this LP, you've been cheating. And you now, you finally got caught up. But um, anyway, guys, I hope you guys are enjoying your day. Do not forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I will speak to you guys soon in the next part of the Cry Baby Whims Challenge. Bye, guys.